Congratulations, Richard. How are you feeling? Oh, thrilled. Um, from the first half performance to the second half performance, there's a massive contrast, and I thought the boys delivered today. Um, there's a lot of inexper not inexperience, but there's a, a mix of um, young boys and some senior players in that team today, and, and I thought they gelled really well, and they put in a performance today, which ended up deserving in the win. Yes, yeah, so take us through that first half. There's sort of a lot of defensive play, good stuff. Obviously, we want to be on the, we prefer to be on the attack, but the defensive display was a good one. Yeah, no, it was great. Um, Mainly from our errors, our, the, um, we had to implement our defensive structure. So, you know, that's one thing that we need to tidy up in the first place. Uh, some of our set piece, um, set piece work, but um, defensively today, our structure looks sound. Uh, the boys um, implemented what we want throughout the week into the uh, into today's performance, and I thought um, Cardiff threw everything at us in that um, last 30 minutes of that first half. And to be fair to the players, they they stood up and fronted to, to that challenge and uh, and rolled it out to, the, to half time, which was fantastic. And being a former player yourself, how does it? feel to sort of see Hookie uh, kick over the top but it goes to Luke Price to sort of experience to youth and then go on to score a try. Oh, it's, it's brilliant you know and, and it's great for, for the players like Luke and things you know they those boys get the opportunity to play with such experienced players and well and you know household names and to see them boys thriving in this environment is great and I think you know from from my perspective as a coach it's, on, it's only going to get better for these boys they can just learn massively from from the players around them so um, I just want to see more of it really so more integration will be better for these boys development. Is there anyone in particular that stood out for you over the last sort of two weeks? Uh, we've had a, 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 sorry a, yeah a couple of key players you know we had like Luke at 10 and uh, Ruben playing in at nine and like I said we had a, a, a good mix with some of the senior players like Robin Custer put in a performance today you've seen like Will Jones has been um, one of the key players for us over the last two weeks as well so he's been putting a massive shift and you know I couldn't name the majority of the players today because it was a team performance you know especially from a defensive perspective um, everyone had to be on, on the money there and like I said that 30 minutes in that first half probably got us the win in the end. And what was said in the change room at half time that sort of gave them the shift that they needed? We're just saying, look, you know, as great as that defensive um, set was, we just don't want to be doing it for the rest of the game. So we just spoke about the boys just being a bit more clinical in attack, um, getting the, the, the set piece right and, and just making sure that we kept the ball. And when we kept the ball, we looked dangerous. And like I say, we scored, ended up scoring two tries, yeah, uh, from open play. And, you know, it, it all generated from good momentum from set piece as well. So, you know, we just want to be playing more with the ball than without it. As great as our defensive setup was, it's just as an Ospreys team and, and as an attacking coach, you just want to see the boys playing well and playing on the front foot with the ball. And how does it feel to sort of have, well, you've got three kickers in there tonight, Hooky, uh, Sam Davis and Luke. Um, some surety in the squad, you know, that you've got that backup for a long, short range. Yeah, no, it's great. And I think with with those boys within your within your squad, you've got the opportunity to implement a great kicking game. And like you said, you've got Hockey, Hockey and Luke are both uh, right footers and Sam is the left. So it, it can um, play havoc with uh, the opposition defensive back three, and um, which which worked today. Like I said, we had an opportunity from a counter attack with a kick over the top. And then we took the uh, took the opportunity and ended up scoring. So you know, it was fantastic for us to have those players within that squad. Um, we saw the loss of two centres, unfortunate tonight. Did that ever cause any sort of stir or any worry or any? Was it easy to move people around? Um, with the type of players we got and the squad we got, um, it's not easy. We've been unfortunate at the moment with injuries, but to be fair to the players we put on the park tonight, they just got on with their jobs. Um, yeah, there's a few boys playing out of position, but like I said, you know, they're just playing for that badge on their jersey, and that's what we wanted tonight was for them to step up, front up, and be a true Osprey.